In this video, we'll explore how to navigate your ebook. Once you open up your ebook, you'll be directed to the table of contents. Each chapter of your ebook will be listed down the center of the page. To open up a specific chapter, simply click on it from the list. This will open the table of contents for the chapter. You can navigate to a specific section of the chapter by clicking the relevant link, or you can work through the chapter chronologically by clicking the arrows that are listed on the sides of the page. You can maximize or minimize the text on the page using the A icons that are listed in the top right hand corner of your screen. You also have the ability to annotate the text. To do so, simply click and drag over the relevant text on the page. When you release your cursor, you'll be given the option to highlight the text, add a note, use the dictionary, have the text read aloud, or create a flashcard based off of what you've highlighted. I'm going to highlight the text and then I'm going to click on it again to add a note. Your note and highlight appears on the page, but you can also access a comprehensive list of all of your notes and highlights by clicking on the highlighter icon that's located on the right hand side of the page. Click on the highlights tab and all of your highlights will be listed organized by chapter and section. You can choose to hit the blue arrow to return to the page where you made that note or highlight. Note that you can also print this page. To collapse the My Notes pane, simply click on the double arrows at the top of the page. If you'd like to turn your book into an audiobook, you can click on the Read Speaker icon in the top right hand corner of the page. This will read the entire page aloud. You can select your settings for the Read Speaker by clicking on the Read Speaker icon on the right hand side of the page. Here you can indicate how fast or slow you would like the text read, and if you prefer a male or a female voice. There may be embedded videos available within your ebook. To play the video, simply click on the play icon. In this video, you'll and learn the video about will play in line Windows within 7 your ebook. Windows 8. You can turn on or off your closed captions by hitting the closed captions icon, download a transcript, as well as make the video full screen. Other icons that are listed on the right hand side of the page include a search tool. This will allow you to search through your ebook by page number or by topic. You can also access the full ebook. This will allow you to access all chapters of your e-text at one time. You can access the Merriam-Webster dictionary, a comprehensive glossary of all of the key terms from the book, as well as pre-built flashcards. These flashcards are organized by chapter. You can simply click on the card to flip to show the definition. Click next card to move to the next card. You can add in your own cards by hitting the create a card button here at the bottom. You also have the ability to print these cards as well as choose to show the definition first rather than the key term.